Now at 11, this time the bikes were cut off. Bye. Thank you, Senator, for Leadership. describing the legal process. The audience can't hear you because your mics are cut. What loomed large over the vice presidential showdown? Plus, the city of Oakland hinged its budget on a multi-million dollar coliseum sale. Why a council member is sounding the alarm on whether that deal's on track. And a group of residents sued the city, saying they didn't do enough to stop sex workers and Johns from cruising through their neighborhood. Prostitutes, pimps, and their customers take over our streets. Why some say the city's new plan still isn't good enough. We're being left to feel captive in our homes at night. Plus, it's officially the Buster Posey era for the Giants, and our Vern Glenn is all over it. Has your phone been blowing up? And this beaver is taking center stage in a courtroom battle. Why even the governor's winning it. There was a talk about releasing Nibby into the wild. From KPIX, this is the Late News with Sarah Donchi on CBS News Bay Area. Hello, I'm Sarah Donchi. Is the city of Oakland back where it all started, staring over the cliff into a major budget emergency? Tonight, one council person says she's in the dark about whether the city is about to make major cuts that could be that could include closing fire stations and slashing the number of cops on the street. Now, we have heard this song before. Council member Janani Ramachandran is raising concerns about the sale of the Coliseum. She's worried that the buyer, the African-American Sports and Entertainment Group, missed a critical deadline for a $15 million payment. That could trigger major budget cuts in the city. I am